Beecham House for Retired Musicians. Oh. Life follows a rhythm all its own. Fancy for a little rumpy pumpy. Qu'est-ce que c'est, rumpy pumpy? But a new arrival. Look, welcome to Beecham House. Your room is a beautiful suite in what we call the B-Wing. Sounds like a prison. We'll change their tune. Boys, I know who it is. As large as life and twice as terrifying. I'm going to say something very rude. <laughs> You. Yeah, and you. Poor thing, she's having such a hard time. Move those hips! This is not a retirement home. This is a madhouse. We have a serious problem. We can't make the garlic for the hottest ticket in town. This house could collapse. We could lose it. We have four of the finest singers in English operatic history. I don't think I want to sing with Jean again. They were married once, but no, it no. didn't work out. We were different people then. I have. A brilliant idea. What is it? Oh, I, I can't remember. What is it? <laughs> what made you stop singing? You must understand, I was someone once. Why do you persist in flirting with me? Older man, vintage wine, seasoned wood. <laughs> this is the first time we've seen each other in God knows how many years. 97. <gasps> is it really that long? Everybody thinks that opera and rap are two completely different things. It's just talking for us. And for you, it's just the way that you sing. Their love of life is infectious. They inspire us. It's not too late. You told me to go out and smell the roses. I'm telling you to sing. I think you two are drunk. <laughs> I think I possibly am, although I find it very difficult to tell the difference at this age.